What got you there with got you got you What got you there with Shonda Laney What got you there with Shonda Laney What got you there with Shonda You're filling a bucket but the only way you can fill the bucket is with drops of water from shaking a cloth you can't mm. switch on a tap and when that bucket is full and there's water sloshing over the sides every time you carry it somewhere that is kind of a bucket that's overflowing with goodwill that's when your life really takes off but but the first thing that one has to do is just fill that bucket and there's a very very long time that filling that bucket will take could take 20 years before it's full and it's overflowing with goodwill um and uh and most people give up <laughs> and but if you can just keep going if you can enjoy the process the rewards at the end are really just extraordinary and so the question of how to live life in the most meaningful way possible and holding myself to that standard that is is something that i'm still figuring out and actually sean i think it's got to do with sort of you know making the world beautiful in your own own image so finding ways to interact with people in such a way that they leave the world or they leave the interaction feeling like um you know they're happy that i'm in the world and they're happy that they're in the world and our ability to think clearly about the world and one of the places where it starts is this idea of the capture habit so when you have a thought wherever it is in the shower write it down real quick the idea that the thought's going to stick around we all know what happens it just floats into thin air and then disappears and so you know you could, if capturing thoughts is a bit like capturing butterflies you know you just got to you got to you got to grab them and preserve them while you still can and then later on you can kind of uh, take them out and review them and new things will come out of your thoughts as you review them. Got you there with Shonda Laney. 